Hi everyone, welcome to another video of Joyroot. Today, in this video, we will discuss how we can resize the OS disk in the Azure VM. Not the additional disk, we are talking about the OS disk. Is it possible to increase the size of an OS disk in Azure VM? So, uh, and we may have a question, is it possible to expand the size of an OS disk? Is it possible to decrease the size of an OS disk? So we will check it out in the lab. I have already logged into the Azure portal and created a Azure VM over here in the name of test VM. So if you check it out, the test VM overview, I have created it in the uh, E2 series and the, it is V3 version. Two CPU and 16 GB RAM is allocated. We have allo given a public IP to this machine. And <clears throat> the machine is in the deallocation state. If you go virtual machine, you can see that machine is in the stopped deallocate state. If we want to increase the space of a uh, OS disk, it should be deallocated. Live, we cannot uh, increase the size of an OS disk. So let us check whether we will be able to expand it, whether we will be able to decrease it or not. So to do that, I have already shut down the machine. Anyway, uh, by once the machine is in the start mode, we won't be able to uh, expand the disk. So I have already deallocated the virtual machine over here. And the left hand left hand side blade under settings we have something called disk here so i'm clicking on disk so the disk is loaded over here and here you can see the os disk and here you can see one more additional disk in the name of f drive i have allocated already with this particular virtual machine so in this os disk i have allocated 256 gb and it is in primary ssd lrs so I am going to expand and decrease. We will check it out whether it is possible to expand and decrease the size of an OS disk. So I am clicking on the uh, disk name. So and size and performance in the left hand side blade. I am clicking on size and performance. So presently it is 256 GB and uh, IO, IOPS it is 1100. Position and uh, maximum share all those details we can see over here. And this tire it is P15. So presently it is 255 GB. So is it possible to decrease that? No. We will not be able to reduce the disk size is not supported in the Azure to prevent data loss. So if you try to uh, if you decrease the size of a Azure VM or S disk, then what happened? There will be data loss. So uh, Azure portal will not support to decrease the size of reduce the disk size is not supported in Azure to prevent data loss. So we will see whether it is possible to expand the size of a OS disk. So it was 256 GB. I am trying to expand it to 512 GB. Yes, it is possible to uh, expand it to 512 GB. So I am just expanding to, uh, I am just double, I am giving double size to uh, from 256 GB to, I am giving to 512 GB and I am saving it. So the space is, <coughs> it is updating, yeah, successfully updated the disk. So we will check it out whether that space is available in the disk. So I will have to um, start the machine. So I'm starting the machine and we will take the RDP of that machine. So, sorry. I'm taking the RDP of the mission, MSTSC, and this is the public IP of that mission. Yes, it is still, uh, maybe it is still starting, so it may take few seconds, few minutes. So I'm getting, yeah, it is uh, started, so I'm just trying to log into the machine. One. Okay, I'm giving the strong password and logging into the machine. I have uh, already logged into the server now. Now I'm going to the disk management. So for that disk mgmt.msc command I have given in the run prompt. And I'm in the disk management. So yeah, another 256 GB which is uh, allocated now is available here. So to uh, attach it to the C drive, we have to click on extend volume. Click on next. 
the NDA 256 GB I am attaching to this particular disk C drive and finish it off. So 512 GB, 526 GB is available now. Let us check in the C drive space now. Yes, so you can see some 526 GB. <coughs> 526, right? It's still showing the old old capacity there. 512 GB. So 512 GB we are able to visible here. 511 GB. Okay, this is the way how we can expand the size of an OS disk. So it is not possible to decrease the size of an OS disk due to the data loss prevention. So that's it for this video. If you like this video, please do subscribe me. Uh, and I have already created a few other videos related to Azure portal. So you can watch that and support me. We'll watch you in another video. Bye. Thank you.